हेलो फ्रेंड्स आई होप यू लाइक द फर्स्ट वीडियो ऑफ द सीरीज ऑफ लर्न सिलोजिज्म स्मार्ट किडा वे इन द प्रीवियस वीडियो वी लर्न द फोर टाइप्स ऑफ स्टेटमेंट्स दैट आर ए ई आई एंड ओ एंड नाउ आई एम गोइंग टू गिव यू सम स्टेटमेंट्स एंड आई वुड लाइक यू टू रेकग्नाइज द टाइप ऑफ द स्टेटमेंट बाय रीडिंग इट दिस एक्सरसाइज विल हेल्प यू बिल्ड द टाइप रेकग्निशन पार्ट विच इज ऑफ हाई इंपॉर्टेंस when it comes to solving the actual problems so let's start here so here is the first statement which is some students use pens so are you able to recognize the type of the sentence yes it's an i type statement as you can see that sentence is starting with the word some and it has no negative inferences in it so it will be an i type statement Now let's have the next statement. All snakes are reptiles. So what's your pick here? You can see that the sentence is starting with the word all and has no negative inferences in it. So the statement will be a universal affirmative statement and that's called an A type statement. Now here comes the next statement. Punjabis are fun loving You can see that in this statement the word Punjabis is being used in general sense and the writer or the speaker is taking all the Punjabi people into consideration so it means it will be a universal statement and as there is no negative inferences in it so it will be a universal affirmative statement and we'll put it in a type category now let's see what's coming next most of the toys are not pens now you can clearly see that while stating toys in the statement the writer or the speaker is taking only some of the toys and not all into consideration and as the sentence has the word not in the predicate part so it will be taken as an example of a particular negative kind of statement and therefore we'll put it in o type category now let's have some more examples so the next statement is vikram is not a cook here you can see that the sentence is starting with a name of a particular person and has a negative word not in it and therefore it will be an e type statement as it forms a universal negative kind of statement now the next statement is at least some nurses are nuns you can see that in this sentence the sentence is starting with the phrase at least some which means that the writer or the speaker is taking only some nurses and not all into consideration and as the sentence has no negative inferences in it which means the statement is a particular affirmative kind of statement and will denote it with letter i now let's have the next statement only steel is safe for furniture now the statements beginning with only or alone are called exclusive prepositions or statements such statements can be reduced to a or e or i kind of statement but usually while solving a syllogism problem in exam it is advisable to reduce an exclusive proposition or statement starting with either only or alone to an a type or a universal affirmative kind of statement therefore we'll take this statement as an a type statement now we have another statement here which is not a single player is honest now you can see that in this statement the sentence is starting with the phrase not a single which means the writer or the speaker 
is taking all the players into consideration but in a negative context and therefore it will be taken as a universal negative kind of statement and therefore we will denote it with the letter E. So friends you saw here different statements with their kinds or types. Now judging the type of a statement is of extreme importance as it will play a crucial role while solving the actual syllogism problems. Now I would request you to go through as many different statements as possible and build a habit of judging their types as you read them. It will help you a lot in the long run. So friends this is it. Now in the next video I am going to explain you how to derive a conclusion out of a single statement. Till then keep learning and have a great time. Thank you very much.